What's up everybody, Coach Stuby here. Today I'm gonna be taking you through how we would coach our landmine split jerking performance course. We really like this exercise because it allows us to focus on aggressive triple extension while at the same time developing the ability to create dynamic stability from the ground all the way up into that overhead position where it's really gonna require them to own that split stance by producing force through the foot so that that stability can travel up chain all the way up into that hand. How we wanna do this is we wanna coach them to be feet straight under the frame facing the anchor point. We wanna be standing at the end of the barbell. We want to hinge at the hips, bend at the knees, lowering ourselves down to the landmine, pulling it up and getting it into a goblet position right under my chin. Coaching from the ground up is we wanna maintain a rigid ankle. When we go into that triple extension, we don't wanna see the energy leak where my heels are dropping out from under me and getting that force production loss. We wanna stay rigid and strong in the foot and ankle complex. From there is I will pick what arm I'll start with. I'll do two reps on my right and two reps on my left. Biggest thing is making sure the end of the barbell stays off of my shoulder and that my elbow isn't crashing into my ribs or my side. I wanna stay rigid and stacked at the shoulders. From there, I will just hinge, so I'll push my butt back, okay, not just bending at the knees, hinging butt back. Whenever I dynamically triple extend ankles, knees, and hips, I will punch overhead and finish in a split stance with my opposite leg forward and opposite leg back. I'll give you an example. I'll dip, drive, and finish, maintaining good position overhead where my biceps by my ear, I will regain my stance and then lower the barbell down to my shoulder. Okay, again, we're gonna dip, drive, finishing overhead. Notice strong forefoot lowered in that front foot. Back heel, I'm not allowing that heel to drop and I'm not necessarily focused on having terminal knee extension on that back leg. Switching over after you complete all the reps on one side, you switch, barbell off of my shoulder, elbow off of my rib cage, dip, you can add a pause, Punch, finishing overhead, strong platform at the feet. Again, dip, drive, finishing aggressive overhead. Big focus point here is making sure we're not going same arm, same leg, or ipsilateral. We wanna keep it contralateral, finishing right arm, left leg forward, good, strong, stable platform, trying to get into that split stance as quickly as we can. Give it a try with your athletes and let us know what you think. Until next time, thanks guys.